All right, now we're doing 7Q, find the next perfect square. This is by K. Furley, and uh, 90, excuse me, 89% of the people like it. Maybe the K is silent and it's just Furley. Who knows? Uh, maybe the K and the P are silent and it's K.P. Hurley. Who knows? Who knows? Uh, we might know some pretty large perfect squares, but what about the next one? Complete find next square method that finds the next integral perfect square after the one pass as a parameter. Recall that an integral perfect square is an integral, excuse me, an integer in such that square root in is also an integer. So it's a, it means that the square root of the number is an integer. There we go. And if the square root of the number is not an integer, we're going to put negative 1 in there and then quit right there. All right? So let's knock this out real quick. Um, here we go. So if, uh, oh, first off, math.square root function returns a square root of a number. All right? So we're going to be using math.square root a lot. So if math.square root of square uh, remainder operator 1 so if this divided by 1 if the square root of this divided by 1 has a remainder then we're going to say return negative 1 okay because if it has a remainder clearly it's not an integer uh, and if not we're going to return um, uh, let's put in parentheses here let's say math dot square root square and then we're going to say the next one the next perfect square is that what it's called perfect square the next perfect square is definitely going to be whatever this is plus one okay it's just logically how it works and we're going to square that all right and let's see what happens just like i thought awesome but you know what we can make this shorter this is a lot of typing uh, so let's knock that out real quick. So we can say const this equals this and then have a little arrow right there. And right here, we're going to say uh, math dot square root square remainder operator one question mark. So if, if that's the thing, we're going to say negative 1. And if not, we're going to say parentheses math.square root sq uh, oops, don't forget the plus 1. And don't also do that. Uh, plus 1 squared. Alright, let's see what happens. Test it out. Looks good. Awesome. Attempt it. Submit it. Very much like this one. Let's go to my solutions. Just a few of us. Best practice in my opinion. And we'll see you next time.